And I think that's what attracted me to it in the first place. Because the first time I smoked, I was just like, oh, please smoke nothing. All the thoughts have just been silenced. Yeah. Oh, wow. I'm going to do this forever. <laughs> so, now, so I understand so now, the dependency. Yeah. yeah. So now, all right. So now that brings me back to your question, which is, well, you're worried that people get um, dependent. dependent. So this, this is something I, I have to try to explain to other parents, other patients. It's kind of like you have been suffering with something your whole life. Mm-hmm. Now it's built up to a point that you end up in the hospital. Mm-hmm. It's not this year. And then we figure out what's the thing that's good. Mm-hmm. Right? And then we offer you something that could help you cope with it. Cope with it right? So, you might get no, so no, you don't get, it's not that, not that, no, know. also it's like, you're not dependent on the medication, it's just that if you take this medication, the symptoms are removed. Yeah. If you don't have this medication, yeah, you're yeah. going to go back, you just go back to how it was. Yeah, yeah. Sure, sure, sure. I guess people are just, were just hoping that they'll take a medica- some medication and never take it again. A lot of people think that that's what, what drugs are. Yeah. A lot of people have the misconception that if you take something and the symptoms ease up, you don't need to take thing. Yeah. That that's it. It's a cure all, and well, that's the better, so I don't have to take the thing anymore. A, a lot of people have that issue, and I don't know what it stems from. You know, uh, I don't know if it's a primitive mindset or. If it's just a faulty mindset that you take this treatment and it's supposed to cure it forever. I think there's a lot of suspicion. This a girl, big fall bad. Thinking they have like a greatest thing in the world. It's really treatment, mm-hmm. not a yeah. mm-hmm. There are very few. Very few. Well, no, actually, I like There are lots of cures. But there are also now treatments that we fall that I right. have full. As like, what if you didn't have the treatment? Then you're like, that's suffering mm-hmm. with all this thing you could exactly. be taking. Thank, thank God there is this Some thing. Yeah. As they bring up big pharma, do you think that mm-hmm. um, they create treatments on purpose mm-hmm. instead of cures because it has more money? I'd imagine so. I mean, I imagine it would tend towards that because it would be just more profitable. Yeah. Um, but I don't know. I don't have any evidence of it. It just makes sense. Like, if you're at any boardroom and your job is to get us money profit for this company, that's what you get. No, it's not just you make me cure. Yeah. So I'm the CEO, you make me cure, and you make a cheap brand. I do it. Like, it's not even just the yeah, company. I that, yeah, I figured that. <laughs> <laughs> the accountant, the accountant wants to know what we invest in it. Yeah. That will have the highest return. Yeah.